Nigerians, it's not very obvious that Nigerian military hmm, just want to finish everybody in Ugele because of those 17 military personnel that was killed in Ugele South. At least, this is getting too much now. Now, they don't finish Okoma community. Nobody's there now. They have raised down the houses. No single soul is living in that place. They don't they go other villages. You understand? That is nearby. They go, they, in fact, this is just too much. Well, I don't want to talk too much. Maybe we just hit this news and get the full details. Veterans need prayers now. And uh, the federal government of Nigeria needs to call Nigerian military in, you know, to order because this is getting out of hands. They have declared seven persons wanted for allegedly, you know, uh, participating in the killing of those 17 soldiers. We are never do investigation finish. We are never arrest and finish. We are not enter another community, you know. They level the place again. Well, let's just hit the news and get the full details. But before then, guys, if you're just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel, share this video, let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is going on. Please subscribe. I beg. Subscribe to this channel. Share this video. Like or thank you. Troops of the Nigerian Army conducting a condom and search operation over the March. 14 killing of Nigerian 17 military personnel at Okoma in Ugele, South local government area of that of Delta State. Yesterday, they invaded another community, Olota, and especially uh, allegedly was killed away no fewer than 10 persons. Yes, they carry these 10 persons, you know, with them. What are their offenses? Make we get you know, the reason why they did this. And this came on a day, the senior advocates of Nigeria, Sands, and the retired judges uh, ripped apart the board of inquiry constituted by the defense headquarters to investigate the March 14 killing of military personnel at the Akuma Uele South local government of Delta State, saying it had no powers to do so. He said the over 200 soldiers entered Oluta in three gunboats this morning. That was yesterday. They, they had the chairman, Matthew Olu, Olu, Olupa, uh, Biggie. Okay. One, another person again, na German Obi Kete, Kenneth uh, Okoro Dudu, and uh, Atwa. And others, these are these people, they, they, they heard them. The witnesses disclosed that the soldiers raised some houses in the community 50 kilometers from Akuma and took with them almost all the speedboats they sighted in the jetty. Gunshots railed in Ulota today, that was yesterday. We asked those in authority to intervene and tell soldiers to leave our community. They left with those apprehended, no fewer than 10 persons. They burnt a German's house and two others and destroyed one. They also left with many speedboats at the, the, the jetty belonging to residents. They beat the community chairman to his stupor before they moved him with the others, along with the 70 a 75 engine powered boat belonging to Kenneth. This latest crisis may not be connected with Akuma. Record that the army had visited the same community and others, including um, one uh, Achiriwe uh, Oriri and uh, Amosoma, okay, Amosoma, more than a week ago, searching for arms and ammunition. And snatched from the dead uh, soldiers and fleeing suspects. Meanwhile, senior advocates of Nigeria, uh, Sands, and retired judges have ripped apart the board of inquiry constituted by defense headquarters to investigate the March 14 killing of military personnel at Akuba in Ugele South local government of Delta State. 
they told the federal government that the correct thing to do was to institute a judiciary commission of inquiry into the incident or ask Delta state government to set up one one up. The military person, uh, uh, panel headed by Air uh, Vice Marshal David Ajayi uh, stated started sitting Wednesday in worry. However, a Okoma community whose leaders and lawyers said the displaced residents were hiding and suffering in the forest because of the condon and search operation by the army rebuked the hearing. But six representatives of o Okoloba community in Bomadi, local government area, uh, whose boundary disputes with Okoma triggered the, the tragic episode appeared before the Ajayi led board of inquiry on Wednesday afternoon, while officials prevented the reporters from covering the proceedings. Olai Wale Afolabi San and Chief Magistrate E.O. Efio Kuro retired advised the federal government to, to order the army to vacate Akuma. You understand? They said the federal government make it come out, you know, for make me then tell the Nigerian uh, soldier, me then come out for them. Okay. Say this one done too much. So Nigerians, when they see and say, this matter now, it don't come out for be careful. The way this thing they go now, you don't come off for be careful. And you go good, make with they do things professionally. Yes. Because now all these things they even they cause some problems. When we say our military, you know, personnel, they 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 they, they, they suffer. When you don't do things accordingly, you go suffer. Um, you understand? People will take you for granted. Because they know, even if they are not wearing uniform, even if they are not lawyers, they know the law. So, guys, let's hear from you. What's your take? Kindly drop your comments below the comment section. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is going on in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you.